YouTube. This is Keisha and Moni. And we're here today with a wig review. I was so excited. The first time I saw this wig, I fell in love. I've never tried Outre before, but this is their lace front wig. It is in the style carry right here. It says on the box that they have the available colors are 1, 1B, 2, 4, 950, DR2730, DR30, DR425, DR Red, DR Violet, PLT1B slash 2730, and PLT1B slash 425. And just to let you know. I got in the color red. I mean in the color um, 4. And just to let you know, that means that it comes in a natural black color. It comes in a dark brown regular brown it comes in a 30 which is a blondish color like the color that beyonce normally has her hair that's around a 30 and it comes in a violet a red and a burgundy i prefer the four i just that's what i always get one day i will step out of my comfort zone but as of today i'm rocking a four and this is the as she said, Outre Lace Front, it comes in um, their beloved L parting that every um, synthetic wig company loves to do. And also they say that it's heat safe up to 400 degrees. So. We're not putting any heat on this. No. But I'm absolutely in love with, once I saw this picture, I was in love. So we're going to take it out of the box. I want to see, and I received this wig from a wig company called Ebony Line. I had never ordered from them. It took me about a week to receive it, the wig. I ordered it on last Tuesday, and today is Tuesday, and I received it today. And getting the wig to look natural is more of my specialty. They don't want him to press it. So that whole thing is more um, of what I do. So I'll let you know how it's looking on that end. I also might do a video on um, how to make synthetic wigs as natural as possible. Now I will say that one thing, the lace is rather soft. The parting space, it does need to be tweezed or at least some concealer put in. Um, yeah, it's not too bad of a parting space. The issue isn't towards the back. The issue is more of this area up in the front needs some care. Um, the wig is looking a little, it's, it's nice. The curl's looking a little stiff. It definitely needs to be brushed. And it's also... Probably finger combed, maybe. A little finger combing. I probably will brush it with the paddle brush. But it also... Um, is a yaki is a yaki straight texture, so it's supposed to mimic um, African American hair. Yeah, blown out African American hair, and it looks believable. And it's it's a pretty it's pretty the curls in it, and it also is shorter in the back, so it's a nice bob, and it's definitely workable. So to get started, I will start off by cutting the lace and. Yeah, I'll definitely cut the lace. And then we'll okay, so this is the finished product of what Moni did. She took it and she brushed it and everything. She cut off the lace. We have not yet put the concealer in and plucked the part, which we will do. But for the sake of time, we just wanted to go ahead and show you what it looks like all nice and um, brushed styled. out. Right, styled. And so I'm really, really feeling this wig. I really, really like it. I can't wait. I might wear it even to work tomorrow. I think it's cute and sassy, but it's still work appropriate. And, and I what like I would it. recommend someone to do is if you have a curling iron or a wand of some sort, um, you what I recommend because it does sit a little high. This part right here, just set a wand on it for a few seconds to get it to lay flatter. Under four hundred degrees. Yes. Under four hundred. Be sure under four hundred degrees. The the most I recommend is like. Mm, Three, three, three fifty maybe. Yeah, I won't more than that. Now, just to let you know, it does have combs. It was hard to find the one on this side, but it's about somewhere about right here. The comb on this side is right here, which is normal. It does have a comb in the back and adjustable straps. 
Now, I feel like I have a big head, and this wig actually feels pretty comfortable on me. The lace feels good, and it feels rather snug without feeling too tight, at least right now. I will have to wear it a little longer to know if it really is totally good for my big head. But aside from that, I really, really like it. And I think this is a definite go-to wig for every day if you want to. You know, you want to feel cute, you want to feel sassy. But at the same time, you want to feel like you're put together. I think mm -hmm. this is a good wig. Yeah, so just, 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 I will, I have decided I will be doing a video on how to make wigs look natural. And then the thumbnail will, you'll be able to see it once it's done. So that means plucked, I mean, part plucked, concealed, all that good stuff. So, so yeah. Thank you so much for watching. We hope you're having a great day. And don't forget our giveaway. Look for the link to that video in the description box below. And that's it. Bye. 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 Bye.